Hey everybody, how's it going? Today I have a lot of packages here today to show you guys. And wanted, there's a lot I have uh, today. I've been saving up for, for some upcoming videos. And today I have, yeah, like I said, I have a lot of packages that I've opened up. Like, there's a lot I got from the Funko store. And it's mainly because um, I'm sure all of us are aware that Funko is just increasing, has just increased the price of just by, but like, for the tiny pops, they're like now up a dollar, so now they're twelve dollars from from their sites, and that's a like a big price upgrade because of like the shipping shortages that are like happening around like like boats. It's what's causing the problem since the holidays are around us. But I was lucky enough to get them while they were still in their original prices. And I'm going to show you guys what I have here today. And before I do, like, comment, and subscribe for more videos that will be coming out very soon. And we appreciate it, appreciate it for it. So let's get started. So first, first one I got is the package from Funko. Like I said, I was able to get them from before they were going to be increasing their prices. <clears throat> okay, so the first the first one we got here is this this first one is Pikachu from Pokemon. And Pikachu has a lot of weight positions for, for every Funko figure. Like the first one was like just him like in a regular stance now it's only a target exclusive and after that pikachu has like many more positions on where like a waving pose an angry attack stance and this one this one is actually just him in a sitting stance where he is also along with horsey and charizard and i was able to get charizard but he's being delayed so that's unfortunate but i do like this I like this Pikachu position a lot because it's like so cute. And like I'm still planning to get the grumpy position Pikachu where it's like he's just a little angry. But yeah, this is like so that's one Pikachu that I have. I'm going might probably get more Pikachu is coming out soon. <clears throat> and the next figure we have here is We got Mew. Mew is known as the first Pokemon to be known as a mythical legendary. And in the Pokedex, he is also known. Mew is also known as Pokedex number 151 in the National Dex for every Pokemon game. And Mew has like fixed. Mew can transform into any kind of Pokemon that it can imagine up to. Whether they're big, small, or really dangerous types of Pokemon. And I was able to get Mew because like it was about to be out of stock. And I was lucky enough to get it. There was also a Mewtwo one, but I've I've yet to get it. But if it were to be if Mewtwo were to be was restock, I will be able to get it just in time. But for now we have Mew. And I do like that Mew is like in a little stance because like it's floating like any other Mew should do because like it's not gonna be able to stand with it's not gonna be able to stand but I do like how it's really detailed really good <clears throat> Alright, the next next figure we have here is another one of my favorites and it's Pichu So like fun fact, Pichu is actually the first Pokemon that is not Kanto to come out as a Funko Pop. And it's appeared in Gen 2, which is Johto. Peach in the TV show, Pichu was foreshadowed as like a baby Pikachu, which was like a saddest episode because everybody was worried that Ash and Pikachu might not be able to see each other again. And it was like an emotional episode. There were lots of emotional episodes of Pokemon for the TV series. 
but of a Pichu. It's a baby evolution of Pikachu, which you can evolve if you if you get more happiness to it in the games. And if it were to like attack with electricity, it will it would attack itself as well. Not from the games, but in like TV show and other games such as Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. And I do. It's really nice, big Pichu. That's the so that's the first one. the Pokemon that we have. The next one is from Marvel, and this one is from like a very very old time. And this is actually Groot from the Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, this is just the baby Groot from. Their second movie, Journey to the Galaxy Volume 2, where baby group was still just a little seedling. And spoiler alert, the movie songbird from Marvel, group becomes a teenager and becomes like a have an average teenager attitude. And group was actually the real adorable is kind of character to ever have in a Marvel Universe, and uh, I had to get this one, <clears throat> just because I like Groot. <clears throat> and the next one is, we have another Groot, we have another baby Groot, but this one that's, is actually a venomized Groot. So like, there's not a lot know much about the Spider-Man Maximum Venom series. I just know that like, for what we see is all the Marvel characters that we know and love, like Captain America and etc. They're in contact with the Venom symbiote. And so I just wanted to get Groot because, you know, I like Groot. And there's still a little bit of Venom inside of Baby Root. Like even like the little ch the little chompy things from Root and the the roots that are coming out of him. <clears throat> but uh, it's still cute though. It's still really cute and deadly. Like I don't mind at all. <clears throat> Alright so next and we have another one. Well actually it's just from anime. It's a uh, the second wave of the Bakugan series. And what I have, what I have here is Shun Kasami, and this is actually the, from the first Bakugan Battle Brawlers anime. If anybody still remembers it, but I do, but I did show that I have Dan and his Bakugan Dragonoid, to which Shun here also is also a Bakugan Battle Brawler. To which he is a he is a Ventus brawler, which means that it's wind elemental. Which, by the way, Dan is Pyrus, which is fire element, along with Dragonoid. And I do like how they detail like the battle brawlers with like one Bakugan in your hands and a gate card in your other hand, and uh, it's really nice, really good detail on most of these figures. Next and the last one we have here, the next one we got here is is Shun's Bakugan Skyrus, and it looks like a phoenix. Suppose I should. I do remember because like I used to watch Bakugan a lot and I used to collect them. So Skyrus is Shun's Bakugan partner, and is. Really green because like it is a Ventus Bakugan because oh well, I can't think of anything else because like I I don't remember a lot about Bakugan. It's been a while since I've seen at least one episode of it. But I do like how they detailed the Bakugan really well and how they have their elementals elemental icons on it. But it looks really nice how they, they detailed the, 
this figure with like the feathers and with the claws and everything like really good details on it that's why I like it so much okay so next ones we have here are three left one of them is from New York Com from the New York Comic Con exclusive and I haven't opened this up yet because I wanted to keep it for a video but it's actually one figure that I had to get because like there's nothing else there's no other figure that I want of my interest but this is just this is just all mine in his regular form where he has the back and its umbrella as you can see here he's, there's like the little sticker on it so you know so like this version of All Might is just when spoiler alert from like when he was when he finished off fighting up against his enemy all for one and like he has he doesn't have the power of one for all anymore so now he's just a regular citizen in a normal, normal average day world where everybody has quirks. Even after, even if All Might doesn't have his powers anymore, he still inspires a lot of people to become heroes for the next generation. So I had to get this figure just because, you know, I just like this anime a lot. We have two more left, and these are from Funko. This actually, they were revealed to at the same time. And like, just, just, there we go. So these two are from Dragon Ball, just to so know. And and wow, they look so nice. Alright, so, right, so we have here is. So we have the Great Saiyan Man, and just to know, the the packaging was not really good because. I don't think the package was good, it was because like the stick was, was almost close to getting off. But I'm not gonna complain, but. Anyways, this is the Great Saiyan Man from Dragon Ball Z. And it's just Gohan in like a superhero costume. It's just, I don't know when or where, what Dragon Ball movie this is from, but I do know it's from like, from like somewhere in like the past, like right in the middle or before the, right before the Majin Buu saga, I'm not sure. But I do know that that's just Gohan and just a superhero costume called the Great Saiyan Man. And I wanted to get one just because like I, we do like Dragon Ball Z a lot. <coughs> and the last one we have here is Great Saiyan Man's partner, the Great Saiyan Girl. Which is just Fidel in her new Saiyan, Saiyan costume. So like it's just like I said, these two are from like a movie from Dragon Ball. I don't know when or where this is from, but I do know that that's that the Great Saiyan and Saiyan Girl costume are Gohan and Videl. And they do like how it's really nice how they put in details to it. And also notice that they were not really selling real. Like they're still on still on stock at the Funko shop. But that's just people's opinion of how they want to get like their Funko Pops like. Like to me, I do really like it. And that is all the pops that I'm gonna show you guys today. Thank you all so much for watching and if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos that'll be coming out soon. And I got a big one that'll be coming out for next month, which is around Christmas. So I'll see you guys later. Bye bye.